This is Monday, October the 5th, and I am on Mount Trudy along the uh, Superior Hiking Trail in Minnesota. Got a splendid view from here. Three more days and uh, I'll be in two harbors and that will complete this incredible 5,000 excuse me, 4,500 mile journey from Lake Sac in central North Dakota to uh, Crown Point in the Adirondacks, Lake Champlain, upstate New York. Well, fall's not totally in full swing here. The birch, the yellows still need to come out a little bit. But you can see the maples are, are in a blaze. And it gives me a little inspiration. Let me do one of my ditties for you. This is called Ma Nature's Paintbrush. Ma Nature's got her paintbrush out, brushing o'er the green. From her palette every hue to brighten up the scene. In red and orange and yellow, she paints so brilliantly. And there, a touch of umber, a touch of umber. She threw that in for me. Now what's all this excitement? It happens every fall. It's nothing but a rerun, in case you don't recall. Well, we've seen the work of masters hanging in our galleries, but none can match Ma Nature's hand when she paints autumn's trees. Ah, tis a magic time of year, a spell cast over all. For all the seasons we hold dear, the best by far is fall. This is Thursday. October the 8th and you can see the blue blaze there I'm on the Superior Hiking Trail which is also the North Country National Scenic Trail this will be my last full day of 186 days over 1500 hours and at uh, around lunchtime today, I'll complete the last four hours of this amazing hike. Totally connected hike, a through hike. From Lake Sac, North Dakota, 4,500 miles. To Lake Champlain, Crown Point in upstate New York been one incredible amazing journey. Oh, the scene we see here this morning very peaceful. This has been a trail of solitude looking out over Lake Superior here and as I swing on around See where the trail goes on up through the woods and way on up there you can see one of the, what will be the remaining one of the last few blue blazes along this great great trail thank you Lord thank you Lord thank you Lord
giant grasslands in North Dakota. Well, it's a Saturday, October 10th. Last time I was here, this thing was sandbagged about four feet high. This is the old ornate, iron ornate bridge across the Cheyenne River at Valley City State University. And this is Certified North Country National Scenic Trail. This is Sunday, October the 11th. And uh, I'm on the beautiful Cut Trail, uh, Certified Trail on North Country National Scenic Trail by Lake Ashtabula, north of Valley City. I had to bypass, actually hike around this section of the trail early on on this hike because of the harsh winter conditions that were lingering into spring. And I'm back here now to fill this in. This section is between uh, the little village of Sibley and Hannaford Bridge. And I'll soon be reaching uh, Karnak Landing where the railroad uh, trestle is and you can see that north of me here. Cold morning. Uh, maybe 29, 30 degrees with uh, a little bit of snow off and on. Beautiful morning to be out here though. Thank you Lord. This is Tuesday, October the 13th and I'm on the North Country National Scenic Trail and the lake you see before us here is Cheyenne Lake in central North Dakota on the High Plains Prairie. What a gorgeous place. From this lake is formed the Cheyenne River by which I've been hiking the last number of days. Lake Ashtabula is the Cheyenne River backed up at Bad Hill Dam. And you can see the ice is beginning to form. See the ducks sitting on the ice on Cheyenne Lake. And you can see my shadow here. And you can see the beautiful Mode Trail. You can see it meandering along the shore there. Very little used trail. Hardly any traffic, I guess, on this. There really is no tread just a mowed path to follow. It's been a glorious day. Beautiful trail. The North Country National Scenic Trail. Cheyenne Lake, Central North Dakota. This is Wednesday, October the 14th. And I'm at the uh, termination of the Klusky Canal. We're looking out across the Cheyenne River floodplain on the North Country National Scenic Trail. And you can see the spillway here for the terminus of the McCluskey Canal.